All right, a little bit later than usual, but just had to finish my meal. I had good sushi for the first time in my life today. That was not the meal that I just finished, but at work today, there was a sushi grilling thing near uh, near work, real close, like two minutes drive. Um, uh, just not quite possible to walk to, unfortunately, but um, that's right, Parker. Yes. Um, but it was really good. I had this like, it was like fire dragon or something. It was not actually, it was not actually very spicy, but um, basically tempura, some, um, who's he wants it? Avocado. I forget what else was in there, but it was really good. Pretty pricey, but um, pretty good. I, 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 I was not impressed. I had, it was like some Whole Foods stuff. Like we got some sushi just to try it when I was in California. I was super unimpressed. Uh, I think it wasn't the right match. It was like, I don't know if it was a California roll. I, the, the tempura really made it for me. So I think I'm gonna go for that. Go for the crab, the shrimp. Calm yourself down. So, there is a new United States event, which is always cool. I was hoping we get the Minneapolis event again before too long. It's that I joined just as that one ended. I can't quite see what this we get. You can get this special like avatar frame thingy if you fully limit break everyone. Including the stupid Loli, unfortunately. Who doesn't even look remotely in character with the rest of them. Like, look at this design, and then look over at this. They usually do a pretty good job of making everything seem reasonably consistent within the game. Oh. My air conditioner's still on. Hold on. That would be a bit annoying in a video, huh? So. But yeah, they usually do a pretty good job of making everyone fit... But they have- they do have tons of different artists. It's actually incredible how well they kind of keep things pretty even. Um, considering the- the- there's gotta be dozens of artists at this point working on the game. So, we're gonna hope to get, um, Baltimore and, uh, Alabama are who we want. So, I guess we'll just do polls now. I'll probably do... Oh, I can only do 20, so I'll do 20 unless I get all of them first, which... Here's hoping! I doubt it. But here's hoping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love how it makes me check the do not finish, do not show this again every single time. It never works. This is the new sub. I knew it. No voice. I think these units are actually new even in China. Usually when a unit does not have a voice, it's new even to the Chinese version. Look at that tiny little hat. So yeah, new sub that- is this the first rare sub? Yeah, yeah. The usual. I feel so sorry for the characters that are the you lose like units. Like, this, this game does- the rates aren't that bad, but it does this thing where like 50% of polls are forced to be these characters that you're seeing. Wow, that was a pretty bad poll. Yeah, that was bad. Sussex, I do need some of. That was... that was pretty bad. Um, unfortunately, we can't do much more than that. I was... I haven't really been saving my stuff. I wasn't... I had a fair amount of money to start with, but I've been spending my money. Oh! Hey, Emma Grumby! She's not part of the event, but I didn't have her anyway, so... Speak quietly and carry a big-ass gun. The gun is so big, you can't even see the gun. It's too big. Her boot too big for her goddamn feet. Alright. She's a monitor, and unfortunately, the stats for monitors suck in this game. I, I wish they would improve that. I saw that four, and I, I, I knew it wouldn't be a good unit. Uh. Hey, Alabama! Awful state, but decent ship. Awful state. God awful state. I'm so sorry for anyone living in Alabama. Best best to you. But yes, there we go. There's that big titty luck we were hoping for. So Alabama and Baltimore. Alabama, I think she's kinda of going for the same aesthetic as um Um uh, 
um, Massachusetts. Is she? Is, I, I guess it doesn't say. Um, I wonder if she's a sister ship of that. Oh, another one of these. Norfolk, get away. Eh? All oh, for Pete's sake, game. Eh, no! Let me... No, go away, Akashi. Um, the other one that we really want is... Um, Baltimore here, who is of course a cop. Because... Because why wouldn't the Baltimore character be a cop? Uh, let's see who we can retire. Like Charles Osborne a lot, but I already got one. Um, none of these. Sussex. There we go. Please be the other super rare. There's still a who? Birmingham. Um, still need her too. Please be Baltimore. That would give me so much relief. No. Nope. Lots of monitors in this one. Alright, we may as well just run out of money then. Don't tease me with those four hours. I know that's just Oklahoma. It's always Oklahoma. Get a lot of that one. Ah, frick. Well, we got two out of the four. Just need Baltimore and Birmingham. Could be worse. I'm not gonna need many Bulins for all one at least. Uh, is Terror any good as like a low oil unit, or should I just use um, like Nevada, Nevada? I should probably enhance some peeps. You know, let's enhance um, Alabama. Um, see, that's Massachusetts. They look like they're going for the same kind of aesthetic. How do you tell? Where's the thing that tells you what class they are? Do you have to go to the, me uh, the, 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 the memories thing? Whatever it's called? Sam Crombie. Let's see what she's got. Yeah, all the monitors just have, like, huge barrages. Cal calm down. Cal calm, calm, do not, calm the squeaking down, please. Good lord. Sometimes it's like a landmine of squeaking when you click on a character. Uh, sure. <laughs> all those Nevadas going to use, I guess. Yeah, sure. Oh, you don't have a voice in? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> I feel like I can beat someone up right now. Good for you. Uh, do I need another Kingusa? I don't think so, but... I'll be cautious. Alright. We'll level you up. And I'm gonna... Yeah, there's all my build ships for the week. Um... I'm gonna put her in the dorm for experience right away. Um, I haven't been playing as much lately, so I've been able to save up a decent amount of curry again. If you need to buy stuff with, uh, if you have spare oil, generally the best thing to do is buy lots of curry with it. It's cheap and it really helps you keep getting experience even when you're not playing the game. Um, I've just been checking in like twice a day lately, waiting for something to do. Um, Place Dunkirk. In fact, you know what? Let's remove everyone except Neng and Ping, because they'll be. Pretty soon, I'm gonna be able to retrofit those two. Monitor classes really start with USS Monitor. Yeah, monitors are really big. No, they're not big. They're they're small ships with really big guns, and they're slow, and they're not really well armored. But they just they're really good for coastal bombardment. But there's no reason. Like, coastal bombardment is not a thing in this game, so they don't really have a benefit. They have skills that fire really big shots, which is cool, but so do lots of battleships, and battleships have, like, effectively, like, five to ten times more HP, basically. It's... yeah. So, we'll level up you. I'm hoping to get that... thing. I got I got absolutely atrocious luck in the last 
Uh, yeah, I'll put an Abercrombie in too. Um, in the last thingy. Where is Abercrombie? Oh, I did a filter. Um, that stupid sub uh, banner, I swear that was rigged. I, I've i never had that bad of luck in a banner. That was horrible. I never got, I never got half the ships. I must, I must have like used like almost 200 cubes. It was stupid. Oh, she's got a freaking scythe. What was that? I've never seen, I've never seen an animation. Wow, I didn't know she had a scythe. Well, we have the best unit from the banner, so that is definitely a relief. Uh, I was hoping to get Baltimore too, but we still got at least a week. Where's the other one? What <laughs> shit eating grin. Very good, very good. No idle animation? Ugh. Some characters don't really have idle animations and it kind of sucks. in the background going crazy. What did, does she do anything? Not really. Oh well, we'll leave them to it for now. Uh, I've got a bunch of this crap to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is anyone actually using the French ships? Like as their main fleet? Um, I'll save that for bed. They seem pretty alright, but you kind of have to use, like, all French ships, or at least an all-French vanguard, it seems like. What's with the numbers name, by the way? Is that just what Twitch does if you join without giving a username? Or is that some kind of deep personal reference or just pseudo-anonymous thing? Give me your life story, mysterious chat member. So it's got the usual kind of rewards things. You get... What's your name? Batan over here, who looks different. She looks, she has like an edgy art style, like very dramatic, which fits this event. I mean, it's called Ashen Simulacrum. You, you can't get edgier than that. That's like near autonomous level edge. Now here's sad enterprise. Let's see, I can get this thing. I have to pull all of these characters. Um. Four of which are from Gashapon. Um, and I have to maximum upgrade them. Unfortunately, that means I have to level up the Loli, too. I'm not looking forward to that, but we'll... We'll save that part for last. This... I don't like this at all. This... This this game's developers... Shake my head. You gotta say it because I'm on stream and you can't see it. Anyway. Let's just get back to the event. Can I... You know, I'm doing the easy things. I bet I could just kind of slip these two in there. Um, put you in there. It won't even cost that much oil. Um, and you. <laughs> I, I wasn't expecting that. Usually they, the monitors sit on the guns, but instead it's the opposite this way. It's adorable. Okay, oh, could you, could you not with the squeaks, please? Uh, give her... Uh, I guess it doesn't matter what reload speed she has, so I'll just give her this thing that I never use. Is this good, by the way? Like, it probably sets things on fire real good, but it's really slow. So I, I prioritize. Hey, that's a new gun. Never seen that one before. I usually prioritize the uh, firing speed for my battleships, because most of them have a skill that triggers on how many times you fire. My internet is looking really good today, and I really hope... <laughs> I really hope it stays that way. I'm getting an upgrade for my internet. It... Probably won't matter for my streaming issues, but, um, yeah. Oops, I didn't finish. Have you seen that gun either? I'm still rubbish at figuring out equipment. Um, usually, just go for 
J just take your highest tier, like for just absolute beginner strats. Take your highest tier thing, get it to a bare minimum of plus six, and just make sure you have something equipped. Because that makes more than 50% of the difference. Um, beyond that, if, you're, if your ship has a skill that tr procs every X amount of shots, you want to give them something that fires really fast. Like this, um, this is pretty much the best gun that I've found anyway for um, battleships and stuff that proc every X number of shots, or every single shot. Like a percent chance to fire. Um, for other ships, they fire every number of seconds and it doesn't matter as much what their fire rate is. It's still nice to have them fire earlier because if the battle is really short they may fire only one shot or if you're really overpowered, zero shots. Um, Anti-air is really confusing. <laughs> oh wait, this is the ox gun. Um, the anti-air just use high tier stuff. It's um, it all gets averaged in. Like, anti-air is really weird. Um, I think this gun is supposed to be pretty good. But I don't know if it's as good as an ox gun. For ox guns, I kind of assume you want the highest power, lowest, like, fire rate gun, because they're usually, like, firing at those, um, bombing ships. I'm trying to level up Rune, that's why I'm using German frontline units. I, I pretty much never use them, but may as well get the ship. I'm just going to give you lots of HP because I should not be taking a level 1 unit anywhere. But yeah, gear, gear is kind of a pain. That's probably my least favorite part of the game in terms of non gashapon things. Also, I always make sure to save a gear set, because just in case I ever use a unit again, even if I think I'm not going to probably use them. Oh, by the way, Minneapolis, uh, or Massachusetts. Um, <laughs> you, you'll see her in battle. It's hilarious. Um, she has this skill that changes her gun type to a unique shell type. So what I did is... This main gun here is really weird. It has the best stats... But, it like explodes, it's like a flat cannon, and it like explodes in a wide spread. Yeah, I'll just max it out. Um, I'm not sh for sure if it's actually her best gun, but she basically avoids the bad aspect of this gun by just completely erasing it and doing her own thing and not giving a crap. Sure. Oh wow, you need a lot of extra firepower, huh? She's very quiet. Big titty goth GF. Um, <laughs> and Crombie's grin freaking cracks me up every time. Look at this edgelord! Look, look at this edgelord over here! That is... She thinks she's freaking Haseo. Um, I'll put an extra cruiser here just to protect the tiny babs. My problem, my problem with trying to get rune is I, there's not actually a lot of German cruisers. <laughs> And pretty much the best ones I have are Deutschland and Leipzig. I'm missing Graf Spee. She would be my third best one, but I'm just gonna stick Deutschland in there. Speaking of Deutschland, I just got um, Made in Germany and Untitled Rammstein album number two <laughs> in the mail the other day. Uh, I haven't listened to them yet, but I'm excited. Let me... Let me just fill out these fleets here. I have enough oil, I don't really need to be picky. Who is low level and needs some sweet experience juices? Um, by the way, if I have a low level unit that I like actually should be using, feel free to let me know. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen a unit. <laughs> Units don't usually go as far as she does, it's pretty nuts. I kind of like Super Gamer Kazuna AI, but she starts every battle by literally screaming into your ear, and that, <laughs> I'm for grinding purposes while I actually am listening to the game, 
probably not going to do that. Um, let's level up Xiao Hao. I want to actually get her over level 100 so she's more ready to use. I actually need to keep Monkey on my team here because she has my anti-sub gear. Apparently you need anti-sub gear for this event. I'm actually kind of excited. I don't usually bother with that, so I'm a little bit annoyed, but it's also kind of neat that there will be anti-sub things. So this is going to be my anti-sub fleet. Why? Oh. You have no gear. <laughs> I've, I've never equipped this unit. Okay, I'll just, just... It doesn't matter. Just put things on. If you, if you don't have gear, it's not like you don't have gear. It's like having the worst possible gear. It's like, they it auto-equips fake gear onto them, but it's absolutely terrible. Just my sub-fleet and my dom-fleet, yes. Um, again, don't care, just gonna get... Just gonna get... Ugh. I have so... <laughs> I have so many... Anti-air is probably my least favorite part of equipping. Okay, gonna give you a uh, thinger. Gonna give you some depth charges. Sure, I'll take those. Gonna give you. X gonna give it to you. Let's take that. Sure. By the way, you only need one unit with sonar. For the most part, if you if you lose your unit with sonar, then you're SOL and you can't beat the sub. But um. It's kind of interesting, you actually fire depth charges as long as you're a destroyer or a light cruiser, even if you don't have them equipped. Um, I think Mongi can stand her own. Mongi here is actually pretty good. Oh, you don't have a gun! Where did your gun go? I'm sorry. There you go. I just take things from other people. Oh, Donkey doesn't have any guns. God damn it. I really wish there was an auto gun equip thing. I don't care how bad it is. I just want to have things equipped. Because thing, having thing is better than not having thing. You, I will give... I give Hugo your thing. Oh, whatever. You can use this one. Oh, hey, Perry, what time can we do Borderlands? Because we might be doing that Sunday, if everyone can. I talked to a guy from work, so we'll have a fourth person. Um, I need to unequip little Sandy. She's all I gave her some gear, because I was grinding American troop stats. And I gave her a bunch of really good gear, and she's one of my lowest level units. So she's always away on missions, so I can never recover her gear. Annoying. Grinding the Japanese fleet might be even worse. There's more of them, but the, their cruisers aren't that great. I think Sendai is one of their better ones, but I don't have Sendai, and she's a real pain in the butt to farm. She's level, she's chapter 12, which is not really a grind-friendly level. Like, I have to bring full gear and stuff if I want to do that. Oh, I missed, we missed the first. Um, let's just talk about stupid stuff like, oh, read. I'll show you the first thingers. When are we gonna get this, by the way? What was, what was, what was the deal with this? I, I started playing this game nearly a, a year ago at this point, and it says coming soon. It's always been coming soon, forever. Where's. When. <laughs> what, what, what's the deal? Does even China have the extra rewards for getting the ranks? The bands? Whatever that's supposed to mean? Anyway, um, I'm going to show you, because I didn't even read them myself, so I'll be seeing these for the first time, kind of. Um, I'll show you the beginning of the event thing here. Uh, is it at the bottom? Yeah, here it is. Arrival. But yeah, Borderlands, maybe as soon as Sunday we'll be doing um, some Borderlands 1 Enhanced. Um, but yeah, my coworker said that he can do pretty much... Anytime, as long as I give him, like, a couple days heads up. So we'd be... I'm thinking maybe 10 a.m. Sandy play. Sand play? What, what is sand play? Oh, it's the gamer siren. 
I love how Victorious takes up the entire goddamn screen. It's like, out of the way, giant rat coming through. And there's Baltimore, who I don't get, apparently. Hopefully soon, but... But yeah, maybe Borderlands 1 enhanced stream as soon as this Sunday, or maybe next Sunday. Oh! Um, keep Sandy duplicates, by the way. Sandy's retrofit is coming soon for the US server, apparently. We had a little media comm there. But yeah, keep up to three Sandy duplicates. Um, once retrofit, Sandy is really good. Could I not be hearing an air ride s siren, please? It's one of my least favorite sounds. Sea of flames. The dormitory, the hangars, everything was burning. Terror, panic. Rage. Don't you agree this is the perfect voice to read this in? Oh my god, why is why is it gonna be an air ride siren? Of all of the things. Like it's relevant, but I don't wanna hear it. Not this many times. See so yeah, bad things happen, sirens, they're bombing us. There's a cute little prelude mission to this. I wasn't sure what the deal was with that. It just kind of ended all of a sudden. You can stop okay, I'll stop. I'll let's just we don't need that. Um, yeah, there was a little prelude mission to this one. So this might be pretty important plot-wise, I don't know. So here we are at Midway, apparently. Oh wait, it's probably no longer... There we go. Just drama music, not <laughs> air raids in my ear. Yeah, the food stuff near work isn't really too bad. The sushi place is expensive. It was like 15 bucks for like six chunkulets, one roll, whatever a roll is. They're really stuffed with stuff though. It was, it was a moderately filling meal. I just ate a big old steak, so I was fine with, I, I wanted to make sure not to eat too much today anyway, so it was perfectly fine. But yeah, if you really want to get full, you're gonna spend like 20 bucks or more there. But, uh, that's, that's sushi. For, for, as far as sushi prices are concerned, it's not really too bad. It did make me think that, oh, Pita Pit's not really that expensive, are they? I'm just used to having a subway nearby. I mean, they're, they're not the best food, but they're probably the, they're probably the most filling food you can get for about six bucks. I wish this had autoplay. I, I, when I stream, I absolutely adore things that let you autoplay the dialogue, because I'm always afraid I'm going to have to click too fast. Leave your jokes at the door, Hornet. We're all MLG gamers here. I wonder if whoever designed her was like a The Wire fan or a Homicide Life on the Streets fan. It's very fitting that she kind of got a cop design. I'm not sure what this whole deal is here. But this part of things, yes. She looks like Space Miku, as far as the other parts. Which I guess is just regular Miku? I don't know. Unforgettable memories. Okay. <laughs> Are we done with Air Raid Siren, please? It's supposed to be Impregnable Fortress. I refuse. Yeah, it's very traumatic. It'd be this is really long. I skipped it for a reason my first try. I didn't think it would be quite that long, though. What happened? Somebody set up us the bomb. Oh, this is the uh, Bismarck music, isn't it? Caught off guard. Oh my gosh, guys. <laughs> I don't know if I want to read all of this. Okay. B basically, bad things happen, and there's sirens, and we're gonna shoot the sirens. And Hornet got hurt. That's pretty much all you need to know. I, I've, my patience is officially exhausted, and we're just gonna go. I don't. I don't usually read the writing in this game. It's not terrible exactly. There's some stuff that's very. Um, there's some kind of cringe stuff, especially from the very early stuff. Um, a lot of the early translation was actually pretty bad in this game. Um, Vampire's lines, you can kind of tell they never fixed her lines, because she's... Her lines are weird. She's not another Cleveland class, are, is she? 
That looks like Cleveland class stuff. There's way too many Cleveland classes in this game. <laughs> Jeanneau is like sitting on an invisible beanbag chair. Why? Why do I got? Why has it got to be the air raid siren? Why do I got to hear this? I mean, I get that the enemies are called sirens, but not like this. Atlanta. Yeah. Okay. No. No. Stop. Stop. Stop fucking talking about Cleveland. Oh my god. I know Cleveland was a famous ship, but this game fucking gets miles up its own ass anytime Cleveland is, is mentioned. <laughs> it's really annoying. Also, the enemy ships can move. Oh, they didn't move in this one. I guess, <laughs> never mind. Okay, um, in the first stage, the enemy ships could move and they would attack your harbor, and it's kind of neat. It was a new, it's like a new kind of gameplay for this game. This one is back. Fucking Yatsan in the background taunting me. How dare you? Chat's quiet. How are y'all doing today? I got a decent deal on better internet from Medicom, though we'll see if it's actually better. But I can spend $70 to get 10 times my download and 5 times my upload. I don't know why the upload has to be so bad. Like, did you give me 10 times this upload, too? <laughs> She's like eating her glove, if you look. It's. I hope it's delicious. I don't know if you're supposed to eat gloves, though. Maybe it's different if you're a ship girl. Maybe gloves are nutritious and succulent. I don't know. I wouldn't recommend it for humans, though. Oh, there's a fast forward button now, too. I think it's only for the harbor attack missions, though. But I'm, I'm down for any kind of fast forward button forever. I'm incredibly impatient. Somebody's appalled by something in the chat, and I don't know why. Donkey Kong most hilarious jokes. What? What is this? What did Sun Gaming just post? What do you mean, Donkey Kong most hilarious jokes? What does that mean? Donkey Kong can't even speak. Look at that! Look at her shots! It just goes through the fucking stratosphere at light speed. I love, I love her shots. They just go, what? It's great. But yeah, she has a special shell that only she uses. It's like, it's like an orbital cannon. And it, it does more damage the farther away the enemy is. I'm not sure, I'm not sure stat wise, like how it compares overall, but it cracks me up. So I, I like it regardless. Why are Ning and Ping so small? They're puppers. Oh, speaking of, I've almost got <laughs> Ning and Ping ready to retro. <laughs> By the way, for events, uh, even even if you can beat hard mode, I really recommend beating all of easy mode and hard mode because easy mode actually gives you more um, currency once per day it's really worth just clearing it all just to get the extra currency because it plus it'll save you some oil so i always go through the easy mode first and ignore all of the story and then go through hard mode later so you don't get the three, ti the three times bonus you just getting fired up. I guess that's supposed to be her Alabama accent. I'm surprised how well my level one duders are doing. Ember Crombie is halfway down, but defeat all enemies. I can do that. <laughs> I'm so slow. That's probably Ember Crombie's fault, unfortunately. I think your movement distance is limited by your slowest unit, and the monitors are really slow. I wish they would give a buff to the monitors. Give them, give them a retrofit. I really like all of the monitors visually, but 
It's just stat wise, not a lot of reason to use them. They cost a little less oil, but not really a lot. Did they put the wrong gun on Deutschland? She should be shooting kind of in an arc. I like the ships with special firing patterns and stuff. Her voice is weird. It's not quite what I was expecting from that. By the way, the sub can move now, finally. Do I? Oh, I can't check your stuff from here. Never mind. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I just love Alabama going fucking hog wild with that idle animation there. Remember, when you're playing crane games, you gotta put yourself all up on the glass. Just press your whole body into the glass. It's not weird. It's not weird at all. Stupid sirens get to have the cool shark ships. Well, we get to have cool shark ships. Watch your shots. It freaking cracks me up every time. She's like trying to shoot the magnetosphere or something. And they travel so fast. In absolute terms, the her shots travel the farthest, but they go they hit the fastest. Zoop. Oh yeah, and this her, her gun. This is actually a really good gun for her. It fires really often. And it has I think it has the most damage per thing. I don't know how it works exactly with Massachusetts. But I don't know. If anybody knows if... Uh, I should watch the amount of damage it deals, actually. <laughs> Maybe it just acts like a single bullet from the flak, and then, then it would be terrible. Um, and then I would regret <laughs> Max upgrading this gear. But I'll have to see. I'll watch when she fires it this time. This is a really good loading screen, by the way. Even if they're not really sure how pizza works over here. I just noticed Toomst is grabbing the pizza slice, because that's not Laffy. That's, that's a fifth character, a sixth. I'm not sure how many people are on that screen. Alright, watch how much damage Massachusetts does over here. Hopefully to a boss. Yeah, here we go. Alright, hit the boss. Zoop! Did she miss? Well, I mean, she's not max level, but I think she might actually be dealing garbage damage. I can't, I can't really tell. It's really hard to tell. It's hard to tell without, like, removing all but two units from the game. Alright, watch again. Zoop! Were those a hundred or a thousand? I, I couldn't see clearly if that was a hundred. If that was... Four digits, that's fine. If that was three digits, that's ass. Yeah. Calm. Calm, you, calm your body down, please. Why does everybody gotta be so squeaky? Vampire does the laugh better than you anyway. Oops, no, no, no. <laughs> Why is Alabama not taking any damage? My hair is freaking long. <laughs> she goes freaking crazy. Uh, maximum edge.
too bad today which is weird because yesterday I was trying to upload a one megabyte image to discord and it took 10 seconds it was Like her should be doing hundreds, excuse me, hundreds. I'll give her a different gun and see how we're doing. Alright, let's see how much damage she did here. Alright, so she's dealing about... Better internet is not yet. They have to do a. They, they gotta do like a service call thing. Allegedly to upgrade some lines. I'm gonna ask. I got a tech coming before the upgrade. I'm gonna ask them if that actually is necessary because. I, I think the lines have been upgraded and everything here, but we'll, we'll see what the tech says. I got a tech coming the 7th. Fire! So, um. They might tell me that, that it doesn't need to be done. It's just a $30 charge if they gotta install the lines. And I'm saving, um, I'm getting a gigabit internet instead of 100 megabytes down. Um, not a gigabit up, of course. Just like, I think it's like 60 up, which sucks. But it's still better. Um, and it's gonna be 70 bucks a month. I'm currently spending 80 for 100 down and 12 up, so it's a lot better. For a little cheaper. For anybody that doesn't know, with 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 these like plans and things, what they want you to do is call them every couple years. Yeah, it's doing a hundred, not a thousand. Um, they want you to call every like year or two, and then you gotta hassle their retention line. And there's always some kind of discount they can give you. But if you don't call them, then your price goes up by like twice as much. And you don't ever get better internet unless they stop offering you your service. So you gotta bug them about once a year. Just once your bill starts going up again, you can use that as a reminder to be like, Oh, I gotta pester them. I hate that. Calm your frickin' orgasms down, please. Um, I hate that it that it's like that, but that's how it'd be. I don't think it's like it is, it'd be like it is, but it do. I'm expecting 1 GB down and 60 blue pen to be cut in half. I don't know, the down is usually fine. And the up, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. If I could get half, if I could get consistent 30, that would honestly be amazing compared to what I'm getting now. But it's really, I only care about the consistency. I don't really care. Uh, I don't really care about the maximum. It would be nice for uploading to YouTube because it does take a while to upload the, the streams now that I stream on Twitch. And I don't like to export the Twitch exports. That's low quality. Whoa, she gets the first shot. That's neat. I like Dunkirk. Um, Jean Bart is kind of a bitch, but um, Dunkirk is very nice and sweet, and she likes sweets. I was kind of tempted to get her skin, it's just like her eating a bunch of donuts at the beach. It's pretty good. The ideal life. That was, <laughs> that was quick. I like Dunky. Dunky is a really good, she, she'd make a really good grind ship considering that first shot thing. I thought Jean Bart was supposed to be the one that has that. 
It's even better than she ha that she has it, but... First place, huh? Got a problem with that, please? What is... What is this under the hair? Is that part of the horn? Or is that hair? Or is that, like, a horn ring? I don't know. Mongi's supposed to be really good after Retrofit, though. Something isn't right. That was too easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's always a trick. We've been breached! Who's sitting like that? We can see your butt. Stop that. Get some help. <laughs> There's Purifier. She's fucking crazy. She's got freaking booty shorts, too. Purifier? Wait, what? Hey, where did AS go? There was stage AS, but now it's A2. Purifier's <laughs> chibi does not really suit her personality. But it cracks me up. You crack me up, little buddy. Yeah, see, there's a fast forward button. Every game should have a fast forward button. Just always and forever. Commission. Yeah. Jumbutsuki has a frickin'. Oh. I don't think I've ever gotten a ship. What is the ship pool even? What is the ship pool for um, commissions? I've never gotten a ship from one. I don't think. They're so rare. It should just be a guaranteed ship drop considering how rare they are. There's probably not even a good Stupid. ship pool. Like it's probably just gonna give me like Norfolk or something. Stupid. Snacks 5,000 is a great, like, not sentence, but whatever it is. I would like Snacks 5,000, please. It's 5,000 times better than Snacks. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Look at this little shit-eating grin. It's best, best new character of the night. Oh, she's got a little chain. She's so... Everything about her is so dramatic and oversized. Oh, you do have an idle animation. Kind of. <laughs> I just love her going completely off the screen. Mental. Alright, uh, let me make sure that Deutschland has the right gun. She does! She's missing her other gun, though. Oh, her, she's missing her torpedo gun. Which is not exactly a gun, but... You can steal that. Hmm. I don't know why they have to They say they have to upgrade the line. I think I've had, I've had higher internet than I currently do have, so I don't even know if it's true that they need to mess with stuff. But I didn't want to argue too much. It was at the end of my workday, and I was like, ugh. Dare I? Dare I? Ah, uh, nope. I shouldn't have dared. At least I'm gonna get- I'm gonna get this one to max limit break, no problem. Wait, you're a destroyer, not a- wait, are you a destroyer or a sub? You look like a destroyer. Just usually anything under 30 minutes is a sub. But whatever. Just wanna get that Baltimore. How many things do we have? Oh, we're like one-eighth of the way. Someone on the dev team is absolutely unrepentant Lolicon, like, good lord. So, I don't know when subs start happening. I think this is the first time we've had a siren sub, isn't it? Strategic location, blah blah blah. I don't know who's running some kind of 
snowblower or something in the background, but sorry, can't do anything about that. Yeah, Crimson Axes broke off, blah blah blah. Important lore that's way too long for me to read while an air siren is in my ear. Palms, no time to speculate. Gotta fuck about with the things. This... I'm, this is completely diverting, or like, going away from history, too. But I guess... Anytime you hear this music, I guess is alternate history. It's the mirror fleet shit. The mirror sea, whatever it's called. But see, look at that! Super fast. Good stuff. I wish every map let you do that. I guess that's one year anniversary arc? Weren't we supposed to get... We're supposed to get a free sub for anniversary, right? When is the Japanese or the English anniversary? I I started in like October, November or something. Uh, I figured it would have been the anniversary by now. Oh hey, we got sub gear. Calm, calm your, calm yourself. Who's running the uh, hedge trimmer or whatever that is? Wait, where's my second fleet? Oh, oh, okay. I was gonna, I was about to flip out. But see, look at that. That's not Laffy's arm over there on the far right. Who, who is that? <laughs> Who was? What? What was that? Who was doing that? Was that Leipzig? That that voice clip was very something. Oh yeah, but speaking of um. Upgrading my internet. There's this thing called Frick, what was it? Like MetaNet or something? I don't remember the name. But it's um they're bringing fiber. Um I think maybe fiber to the home? I'm not entirely sure. Um Metronet? Metronet, um, they're bringing fiber in, so they'll be a Mediacom competitor for the first time, like, ever. Um, I don't know if it's fiber to the home or just fiber. It says 100% optic fiber. Which I assume is fiber to the home. I can't imagine what else that would be. It's supposed to be a three-year build-out, though, and it started in February, but hopefully we'll get it at some point here. I've had to put up with Mediacom for, I think, eight years now? <laughs> and it's... I'm ready. My body is ready. Wait, why did I... Oh, I just realized there was no reason for me to try to go for that three-star. Stage AS. What is AS? It's never been a thing before. Whatever. Alabama. Oh, there she, there she is! Alabama and Baltimore. Edge Queen herself. She's got like wave symbols on her body. She's got a lot of skill things on her body. I've been enjoying Pokemon Masters, this definitely has its problems. Hopefully... Hopefully at launch it'll be a lot easier to get star power-ups. Those are the... Those are basically the Bulins from this game. It's... 
more or less impossible to get them currently. So obviously I'm not a big fan of that. Did Amber Crombie just miss every shot? <laughs> that, can, that can happen with battleships, but... Alright, I gotta remember to change your gun next time. Homst? Dewey? Who is Dewey? Farragut class destroyer Dewey. Why, why is Dewey not part of this? Reassure them, yes. Okay. Gives you dialogue box options, but there's only one option. It's not really an option if there's only one. It's just a button. I feel like Twitch is a lot more variable in how many people watch. That may just be how things have been lately. See, Donkey does a lot more damage with her, her initial shot there. Maybe I hecked up by using that gun. Oh well, I'll probably find some use for it at some point. Alright, so how- oops. Flagship. Oh, you gotta destroy a lot of escort fleets, huh? All right, we'll just fight. We still don't have this little asshole in the game. She's actually um, a submarine carrier. She shoots like two planes. I'm not sure if they were like ever actually used for such purpose in the war. But yeah, there were subs that had a little aircraft carrier compartment. They can store like one to two planes. <laughs> I'm surprised there's never been a plot to like a Metal Gear Solid thing. Like you think it's a tank. But it's really a sub. But it's not really a sub. It shoots out planes. And then the planes drop the tank that you were expecting the whole time. That's That seems like something that should have happened in a Metal Gear Solid game at some point. And one of them would have been a Metal Gear. Metal Gear! <laughs> Let's play a little Metal Gear Solid 4. Why is Leipzig? Leipzig needs to calm the hell down. I think that's her that's like gasping. She needs to calm down a lot. Can I make her not my lead ship and she won't do that anymore? She's, she's very loud. Oh, 
Look at Dunkey's face. The perfect French expression for all such circumstances. I love this fast forward mode that just goes zoop! Look at this dog. I don't trust that dog. I don't trust it. It looks like a camel dog. Yeah, that's Leipzig. Leipzig is the one having an orgasm in my ear and I don't appreciate it at all. I'm, I'm gonna put Moggy in front. Moggy knows how to maintain her zen. I do like Leipzig's little, like, anglerfish ship, though. It's very cute. More games need anglerfish and stuff. Freaking Abyssrium needs more anglerfish and stuff. Like, what the hell? The game is called Abyssrium, and there's no... Spooky abyssal fish. Come on. Show some respect for yourself. Every time I see Amber Crombie's face, I crack up. It's, it's great. I'm so glad I got her, even if she's off banner. That's I think that might be the first off banner get that I've ever gotten that I'm actually glad to see. Oh, someone hooked an electric fly swatter to Minecraft, so it zaps them when they take damage. That seems exceedingly ill-advised. There, there was a Kickstarter game that did that. They like drained your blood when you took damage. It it I think it got shut down. As one might expect. <laughs> Bernie Sham. Yeah, purif purifier's personality is that she's fucking crazy. What fish is she even supposed to be? Didn't your mom not teach you not to point guns at people, little girl? Leave for your life, you little plebe, and I might just spare you. She's totally the MLG Kermit of the group. So, given what Jano's skill is, I think I can expect what's happening here. This one looks weird to me. I don't know, the face is just like off kilter or something. Oh, there she <laughs> she's fucking huge! She's way bigger than the other ones for some reason. This stat is freaking huge. And she has fucking lasers! Which I should probably... Nah, we're fine. I, re yeah, I remember Purifier. She has goddamn laser beams that the AI is terrible at dealing with. But it should be fine for a short battle like this. We're way over leveled for this. It's been a while since we had Purifier in a mission thing. What is that thing? What is she on? Is it like a hammerhead shark, I guess? No problem. No, calm down, Deutschland, please. I wonder if she'll calm down if I change her costume. Is your normal costume less weird? I like her little sharp ships. No, 
全力で私を楽しませるものを探しなさい。There we go. <laughs> okay, what was I gonna check? Oh, yeah. Let's see if her damage improves. With... Times ten, times two. It feels like she's doing less than the 200 damage per shot that she should be doing. So, it should be 200 times their firepower, actually.、Uh, yeah, I'll steal for more spite. You, you can't be in front because your squeaks infuriate me. Do you have a good gun, Dunky? Oh. I'm running on blue gun plates. Uh, yeah, we're good. Oh, wait, something's gone on HQ. Oh, studying's done. Um. I have 250 coins left.、Uh, I'll ignore those sets for now. Oh, I gotta clear this three times, huh? Deployed less than 10. Does that include the sub fleet? Because I don't need the sub fleet. Does anyone know if the deployed counter. Includes the sub fleet or not? I'll just remove some peoples.、Uh, that should do it. Even if it does include the subs, that'll be fine. Alright, gotta refill my drink. I'll be right back here.
Alright, back. I see you, Parker. I see you watching me. Oh, you do get to choose your submarine fleet, so I bet it does count. Alright, but we got ten people anyway. Okay. Who's this blue young man over here? Uh, yellow grind with this one. Are the blue ones or the yellow ones the stronger ones? I forget. I think the blue ones look better. Oh, BRB is still on screen. Get rid of that. Think about weekday streams. I never know if I'm gonna get like the most people ever or like nobody. Their biggest variance. Oh, right. I should probably start learning skills for the new girls. I forgot about that. Medicom, no. Medicom, please. Not, not today. Somebody please sacrifice a small animal to Medicom so they don't ruin our streaming experience. Medicom demands its tithe in blood. This is a dangerous angle to hold a cake, by the way. <laughs> Please do not hold cakes like that. You want to keep your cake as flat as possible. It's a little less annoying in this costume. <laughs> We're defeating the enemies too fast with the back fleet to deal any damage. This is good, but I wanted to see what the difference is between guns with this thing. I didn't even realize today was Wednesday, but it was Tuesday. Did Peter Pit get like sued over sprouts or something? They used to offer sprouts, and that was like okay. Yeah, she she does more damage this way. I'm pretty sure that one shot. Let me look. I think she only got one shot off, like one bullet off. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she's dealing more damage now. You know what? I'll take her to the boss so I can be sure. That's how we'll do this. By the way, where are the subs? I was told there would be subs in this mission. Maybe they're at the final stage of things. I don't know. Fun fact about Mogami here, the one in the lead. She was rammed... Was it two or three? But she has rammed multiple other vessels on her same side. But still had a very long career, and not exactly sure I would call it unlucky, but... <laughs> unfortunate, for sure. Could have been better. Right, I'll bring you to the boss. You gotta kinda like, keep the enemies from hitting the harbor space. And like the harbor can only take so much damage. It's kind of a neat little thing. So you can let certain amount of ships pass if you need to. 
I like when they kind of change things up a little bit in a non-annoying way. A couple of the Kazuna AI maps got a little annoying at times. One was basically a puzzle where you had to move every single... You had to move both fleets a certain amount every single map, alternating or every single turn. Alternating each fleet every turn. Otherwise you get caught in this electric field that does damage. It, it was a cute idea, but... You had to move in an extremely specific way. It's kind of frustrating. argument over Dexit and Pokemon, you know, removing Pokemon from Pokemon thing is still going on. One of the weirdest things that people said was like, oh, some people are like, hey, why why are we missing Pokemon if they already future proof these sprites? And then some people are like, oh no, they're not gonna reuse sprites, they would never do that. But then you look at Pokemon Go and you look at Pokemon Masters, and those are the 3DS sprites. They do reuse sprites. Good, all, all good, sane developers reuse sprites and stuff, or models, not sprites in this case. But like, it's just how things are done. I don't know why people would think they would throw away 700 models every single generation. And even in the footage, the footage from Pokémon Sword and Shield, um, the Pokémon that were in prior gens, it looks clearly like they're reusing the models. So. saying, but most people don't understand game development, they just kind of say things. They just kind of assume random crap, and just hope that nobody calls it out. What ifs. I want Mrs. Spider Crab on my team. Spider Crabs are very good crabs. I love undersea stuff. I wish I wish undersea stuff wasn't so undersea. I wish I could just go outside and just be freaking eight foot wide spider crabs chilling outside and I can be like, hey, that's pretty cool. That's my ideal world. I think coconut crabs, which are gigantic ass crabs, I think those are like land faring. I don't know where they live though. Yeah, they're land crabs. Um... Oh, here we go! Look at this motherfucker, look at that! It is a hamburger for a butt. But look at that! I love that, that's... It's like real life head crabs, I love it. Where are they from? Um, coconut crab. Where do they live? Most coasts in the blue area. So they're around Japan, Northern Australia, Malaysia, and stuff. Okay. Love coconut crabs, good stuff. Someone get me a pet coconut crab and train it to not kill me. German cruises are ready to retrofit. I just don't have enough plans. We need so many cruiser plans. I think even more destroyer plans. Quiet night. I think I'm gonna finish up this stage here and we'll call it a night. 
It's been fun to stream again and like not have to worry as much about low bitrate. Even <laughs> we've been having low bitrate, but I've kind of managed to survive. It's nice to see that on Twitch a lower bitrate kind of gets me farther than it would on YouTube. Not entirely surprised because Twitch, Twitch is pretty much 99% about the uh, stream arena. No, nobody watches uploads on Twitch. Nobody even watches the premieres really. It's all about the live streams. <laughs> look how distant and like uncaring our main fleet duders look. They're just like, eh, what is? Yeah, Champagne. Need to get some champagne foods. Is that Al that must be Alabama saying fire, right? I don't really get <laughs> Purifier's fucking face cracks me up. Um, the, the, the voice doesn't really feel like it maps. To the extreme edge and stuff. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure she's dealing a lot more damage this way. Let's see. I yeah, I think she does more damage with the regular guns. That's a damn shame. She's got a, her hat is Dr. Robotnik, by the way. It's got the goggle eyes and it's got the, the teethies. It's a good hat. Oh well. Moderately productive night over here. Um. You know, we'll clear it one more time. Just so we see the ending cutscene arena. I think we just need like just a couple more enemy clears to get five star. I love the speed up. Every game needs speed up. No matter how much I love your game, if I love it so much that I play it to death, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need to be able to go faster. I need more of your game per minute. Like, come on. Let me, let me, let me skip the things I've seen 500 times before, let me go fast and enjoy the parts I want to enjoy. Which again, that's something I've noticed really bad in Metal Gear Solid 4. Uh, it's not as bad playing it um, digital. The digital version, um, you get a lot less loading bullcrap. Like, Snake would genuinely take like a 10 minute smoke break. Maybe 5 minutes closer to, but like between chapters, like you would just sit there and Snake would smoke and it would give you, like, it was a loading screen and it would install the chapter. Because the game was designed for like the 20 gigabyte PS3s, which even at the time the PS3 launched, that was pretty small for a hard drive. That was kind of silly. Yeah, they released an update with trophies and that let you um, install the whole game so you don't have to see those loading screens and that, that streamlined it a lot. But there's still like, <laughs> not exaggerating, in the, in the very beginning of um, MGS4, you watch an unskippable cutscene, then you see Snake, and then you crawl under a truck and immediately go into another cutscene. Like, you have, like, if you go as fast as possible, you have control of Snake for, like, four seconds. And then you walk down a street, like, like, one building length. And then it's another cutscene. <laughs> it's, it's infuriating. And the cutscenes have really slow pacing. Like, I enjoyed that game. I did not, I was not part of the hate train for that game. But it gets really silly. And the pacing of a lot of the cutscenes, 
Like, there's this cutscene where, um... I keep wondering if I should stream it or not, because, like, the, the cutscenes are a long way. But there's this cutscene where you see Liquid Ocelot, and... It's, like, 10 or 15 minutes, and there's so many just pans, and, like, he releases this thing that makes everyone's nano machines go crazy, and they, like, they're barfing, barfing and stuff. And it's just, like, you spend, like, five minutes just watching the camera pan around, and there's a bunch of guys, like, huh? What's going on? And then like nothing happens for like a minute and then all of a sudden they're on the ground and they're puking and stuff And then it shows you for like two full minutes a bunch of dudes puking on the floor <laughs> It's like Do we need to see all of this? Do we need to see the whole thing? <laughs> Cursed content maybe it's pretty funny but it's I don't know. It might be more fun to talk about it than to watch it. I don't know. I did enjoy the game, but like you can skip cutscenes. But um, problem is there's like there'll often be like three to four cutscenes in a row, and if you skip a cutscene, it only skips one. And <laughs> so it's like you gotta put in your work to skip the cutscenes. There's also a few things that you can't skip, I think. It's a weird game. Yeah, it's... It's definitely dealing more damage. That sucks, but... Here I thought I had had a special trick. Actually... Her damage doesn't actually seem that different. I'll have to- I'll have to try that out. I don't- I don't know what the deal is. I think maybe she hits- maybe all of the shots are still separate, but they all hit in the same spot. So it looks like there's less shots, but there really isn't. I have no idea, honestly. I'll see if that hit. I want a hat that looks like Dr. Robotnik. Yeah, our next curse content stream will probably be either Beyond Two Souls or uh, Detroit Become Human because I have I already own both of those. Indigo Prophecy sounds like it's the most batshit insane, but I don't own that one yet, and I think it's not safe for work. Mini Cam, you okay? I actually kind of miss that I couldn't tell to the second whether I'm dropping frames or not in Streamlabs because I worry a little bit too much this way. Yeah, Streamlabs, I can't adjust the bitrate rate midstream. So, yeah, it's kind of a non starter. Wait, let me just make sure. Do I have. Yeah. Glorious looks so out of it. She's not my favorite character. The reason she's my set as my secretary on the main screen is because I'm trying to finish her side mission. I just started everyone's side mission and wanted to do them. I love that first shot. I, I must have misread her skills. I didn't know she did that. That's really nice. Makes her a really good grind battleship. So glad I'm slightly more than four sixths of the way to uh, completing the priority ships. Grinding them has been really. It was exciting at first, but like it takes too much experience. And you gotta use specific ships to do it, it's like, well... Why is Purifier so big, though? She's at least twice as big as all of the other Sirens. Like, is she supposed to be like that? Like, she's one of the most important ones, but like, is she literally physically larger than the others, or...? 
Oh yeah, Sim's smug ass is getting retrofit at some point, by the way. Alright, plot. Why does it give us like two stars at the end there? If it bleeds, we can kill it. Oh no, I'm scared! By the by, I've been messing around here. New York back then is having a citywide barbecue party, you should check it out! Aw, oh, you little prick. This is not actually based on a historical event, is there? I don't remember New York Harbor ever being attacked in World War II. Huh? Explode. <laughs> oh my god, I've been giving her the Kermit voice, and this just happened. Hold on. Nothing personnel, kid! <laughs> Unbelievable. That's the best. We'll have an eternity to hell to think about in that one, Siren Scum. I guess I guess she was the true MLG Kermit. Why do they call it NY instead of New York? It's AS2 Ace? When it's AS, it's like a half stage. It's like not a real stage. It's like a Jape. I don't get what I don't know what the deal is with that. <laughs> We're a long way away from 8,000, huh? I feel like there was more good stuff last time. Yeah, because there was guns. You can get guns last time. But there's still more blueprints, so... As long as I don't run out of blueprints, it's not a waste to grind. Oh well. That'll probably be it for today. Um, Hopefully, I get Baltimore. I, I did get my favorite unit from the ship. Hi, Bulin. Um, so, we got Alabama, but I do need Baltimore still and Birmingham. So, hopefully, that won't be atrocious like the uh, attempt to get the stupid ship. Thing. Um, <laughs> I don't even remember. Uh, it was a number. It was an. Oh fuck! Complete waste. Complete fucking waste. Those are both county class or something. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, before I get down to 100 cubes, I was so close to saving up to 300 when that sub banner came and stole all of my cubes. That sucked. I. <laughs> I just wanted one German ship. I didn't even care which one, because the they have a buff where the more German subs in your fleet you have, you get higher stats on all of them. Um, so I just wanted one more. I didn't care who it was. I didn't care what their other stats were. I just wanted one, and it didn't give me one. What the skins? No. I, the school skins are terrible. I'm sorry. It's the same. Everyone has the exact fucking same school costume. They're just. Lame. <laughs> I like the I like the aquarium in the background more than I like the outfit here. The transparent outer skirt is an interesting look though. Whoops. Oh, you're brimming him, I guess. This again that's that's just the same outfit again. She looks traumatized. The Batan looks like she needs some help. And that's just you. The centaur is not. <laughs> What's with the floppy ears? I've I've never heard of centaurs having big floppy elf ears. But yeah, she's in the permanent pool, so I'm not too. I haven't got her yet, but I've just been doing one pull a day on that thing. She looks like. Why are you in my apartment? Who are you, and how did you get here? Get out. I like the cats though. That's nice. But once again, my favorite unit 
<laughs> As is pretty much always the case, my favorite unit does not have a skin for the thing. I guess it's for the best, I have no reason to spend gems now. Oh well. So, good night everybody, thanks for watching. Um, board Game Night Stream, let me toss a link to that. Board Game Night Stream, this Saturday. Twitch subs get in, as well as, um, you know, you can spend just a buck on Patreon to join too. We're going to be playing Mario Party 4. Uh, Mario Party 4 all CPU player drinking game. It'll be really fun. Those always are. So see you then, and maybe Borderlands on Sunday. We'll see. Yes, slow your roll. Oh wait, let me show you this dialogue line. <laughs> you click her boobs and she says, you're holding the glory of the royal navy. In incredible, incredible writing. But not accurate though. Because Lusty over here is obviously the gro glory of the royal navy. Obviously superior. Anyway, that's Azure Lane for today. Um, probably see you on Saturday.